Lunik. Uh, Lunik is really super effective as Bowser and King K. Rule, and they have different play styles. Um, so I think that the good girl is to come watch. I love um, the Lunik hat. <laughs> I know. He's had that forever. I think uh, Kayla, his fiance, got it for him. Oh, okay. That's um, so cute. And, yeah, they are pretty ridiculously cute couple. I won't lie. You can see her in the background. She's watching. <laughs> right. She takes pictures for us now. Um, she's super nice. Lunik's super nice. She's uh, TZW is the absolute homie. Love that guy. He he did, but he's dumb. He, he, he disagrees. He shaved his beard. He was looking like Jon Snow a couple weeks was ago. Was nice. <laughs> yeah. I've come close to shaving my, shaving my beard a couple times, um, but I just every time I get to the bathroom and I have the clippers in hand, I'm like, I can't do it. I just can't do it. I'll trim it. I'll trim it low, but I can't get rid of it. So, looks like we're gonna start with Young Link and Bowser. I think that makes sense. Um, I foresee this being tough for Bowser, honestly. Yeah. I, I've, I love my boy Lunik, but um, with Young Link just having the projectiles, stuff like that, did, um, Bowser's quick and he's got cool combo starters, but just. Having to get in is going to be a fight this whole match. I believe in Lunik, but he's going to have to stay on top of it this whole time. And this is actually a loser's round six. This is not for a place in the uh, winner's quarters, or uh, top eight, like we've been watching. All right. I see what Lunik uh, saw, but uh, TCW saw it as well, and kind of got out of oh dodge. Oh, my gosh. But yeah, dude, that's Bowser, man. He gave him the lazy boy. The lazy boy. Yeah, I mean, Bowser's damage output and kill power, that's what's going to be a saving grace in this match. Like, yeah, Young Link can keep him out, but <laughs> just forward oh smash, man. Um, I personally, I have nothing against Lunik. I think he's such a homie, but Bowser is my least favorite character to play against. I was, yeah, yeah, I was talking to someone about this earlier. Um, I've never hated someone more in-game and loved them more outside of the game. <laughs> Lunik has literally traumatized me. I'm trash at the Bowser matchup against everybody because of how hard he's beat my ass for years. Oh, that bomb super, might have just saved him. Super smart from DCW, converting that save into a kill. And it's even now, but like we were saying with Bowser's uh, kill power. I wouldn't say that. I say he gets like one good down tilt. Right. Yeah, he's going for it. Uh, Bowser just terrifies me because he's so good at killing early and he's so good at living forever. Yeah, I know. And it's just like, when, when you have someone like Lunik, who has a big brain, who's good at adapting, living forever is a bad thing. The key to beating Lunik, honestly, good job hitting that platform. The key to hitting Lunik with a taunt. All right, Lunik, okay. The key to beating someone like Lunik, when you have a character that lives forever and has crazy adaptation, is you just can't let them <laughs> Oh my god! Build your own combos. He just knows. Oh my god, Lunik. It's a matter of not letting <laughs> <laughs> Not letting them think, you know, like you can't let them adapt to you. You have to take it home and take it home quick. Um, but Lunik, knowing what he needs to do here, abusing Bowser's kill power. And I'm not saying this game one's over, but it's not looking good for DCW. The biggest issue, I think, is that like Link, your uh, young Link is going to have like a lot of combos like that. Oh, that was so nice. That was really cool. But Three I just arrows. feel like he has to work so much harder to rack up that percent. Exactly. Whereas Lunik can just like down tilt him or, you know, F smash him. It doesn't even, yeah, just it, just it doesn't even matter. That's the whole thing. It's like, yeah, like, Young Link is crazy. He has those kill confirms. He has that projectile game. But when you have so much power and damage output, it's like, like you said, like Young Link gets four hits for 32%. Lunik gets one, yes. and it's like 40, you know? Um, so good stuff there. Um, TCW kept it pretty solid there, but Lunik looks like he might be feeling himself. Looks yes. like he might be feeling himself today. I'm and not sure who he lost to in winners. Mid-level Bowsers usually struggle with like being combo food, right. but I feel like Lunik's such a smart player that that's not an issue for him. Yeah, he, he just has to get like two good hits and then he's winning. Yeah, it's a, yeah. Like, Lunik has played Bowsers in Smash Four, and like Lunik was like okay at Smash Four until he stopped and just got good as Bowser. And Bowser just fits his play style well because it's like when he gets that time to think, it's like he understands the limitations of his character. I'm gonna get comboed. I probably won't say anything until I'm at 60%, but when I get that say, I'm gonna push it like crazy. Yes. And, oh look, yeah, Bowser has the lava dripping out of his mouth too. I'm sure Lunik will do it again. I do it again, yeah. Yeah, Lunik, yeah. Uh, 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 Lunik, um, he has the world to say of, uh, you know, flame breath in this game. Uh, because it's like, if you get caught in the wrong spot, it's literally like 40%. Yes, it's like, so much percent. Yeah, see? See? Oh, yeah, I yeah. see it. Nice. Oh, uh, okay. Not dead. Good DI on that. Oh, oh my okay. Gosh. I thought he I thought he was dead, but it was Same. just a bomb exploding. Right. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay. Okay. All right, TCW in a good position. Doesn't quite convert into a kill. 
Bowser, the thick boy, spiking into the stage. Up oh, I and mean, Lunik's taunting after every kill. Lunik, he's such a nice guy. What's the deal? <laughs> <laughs> he's feeling himself. He's feeling he it. He's, he's like, look, I'm not stopping anywhere before top eight. Top eight or bust. <laughs> I was going to say, Ooh, that, I, nice, that really flame nice. breath I, in the middle of the stage while <laughs> Toon Link was high is a, a wee bit misguided. Um, so TCW doing good. Great to turn that into a kill. How so much damage! I know it's like, he, like Lunik holds one button, and I'm just gonna get, and he's gonna use thirty percent off of it. That's just crazy. You yeah. just really don't have any way to get around it. Right. His claw went through sword. <laughs> Lunik, stop! Stop it, Lunik! I'm tired of this, man. No, this is actually insane. I. This is the really the first time I've really watched a lot of Bowser in Smash 4. Obviously, I know Lunik is doing well. I think he's 13 on the Ohio PR right now. Um, but just seeing against a character that I mean, people were just so nutty about uh, when this game came out with Young Link. Don't do it, Lunik. Lunik. <laughs> Dude. All right, so Lunik making a statement there, saying like, "Look, I am here to win today." <laughs> um, Lunik is a player he doesn't like um, when he gets a high seat because it sets this expectation in his head, like, "Oh, I'm you know like ten seed at this event, like, well, seat. I can't lose now. Yeah. You know, I have to minimum." Um, he likes to kind of just play himself down, like, "I didn't deserve this. I'm, I'll do okay today. We'll see how it goes." And when he adapts adopts that mindset. He does stuff like that. He's such a humble player, too. He like, is. he's obviously so good, mm -hmm. but I've never heard him, like, brag about anything or no. be arrogant. He's so humble. Uh, Lunik is, I, the thing I like about Lunik a lot is he feels a lot of responsibility for the Smash scene. Like, in Dayton, it wasn't enough to just be good. And I, a lot of people, he actually had a Twitter thread about this a while ago, and a lot of people hopped in and got on his case about it. But he basically said, if you're the best player in your region, you owe it to your region. Like, don't ignore the bad players, play yeah. with them coach them up like if people end up better than you then that's what happens because yeah. it's all it's